Berkatha Yahoa, Berkatha Yahoa Shai, Berkatha Yahoa, Berkatha Yahoa Shai, Berkatha Yahoa, Berkatha Yahoa Shai, Call Halayim La Yahoa, Bahasham Yahoa Shai, Barcha Hakurash, which means all praises to Yahoa is the name of the Heavenly Father, Bahasham means in the name. Yahweh Shai is the name of his only begotten son, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. Baruch HaKodash means in the Holy Spirit, the spirit of truth, the only way you can worship the Father and the Son. Double honors to the apostles and elders of great millstone. Peace, blessings, salutations to all you brothers who preach the gospel in truth and in sincerity, always in charity. And um, Lord willing, it's a quick little lesson. You know, we're just going to um, uh, 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 touch, touch on conduct, you know, and brothers being more circumspect. You know, on, on, on the things you say, on the things you put out outside of this word, you know, whether it be a, 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 at work, your day to day life, wherever you going throughout the uh, throughout the day, whether it be on social media, you know, because this devil, a, 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 like like we've been saying for uh, uh, for years, man, this devil been watching us, man. And now now we, we see it with these different um articles and different things coming out, you know, with a, a great millstone specifically being named. You know, because the Lord uh, uh, says, um, this is, uh, we'll start with this scripture. This is um, 2 Corinthians 5 and 20. It says, now then we are ambassadors for Yahweh Shai, as though the Most High did beseech you by us. We pray you in Yahweh Shai's stead, be ye reconciled to the Most High, you know. So we're sitting in Yahweh Shai's stead, man. So, hey, hey, when you look up the word ambassador, it goes to what down here? Act as a representative, man. So we represent Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai. You know? That's why it's written, whoever named with the name of Yahweh Shai, let him depart from iniquity, man. Because when we carry those names, man, if we're, we're claiming to be uh, 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 the sons of Yahweh, we're claiming to be the disciples of Yahweh Shai, then we should uh, carry ourselves in a certain manner, man. They place their names upon us. Those, those names carry a reputation. It comes with a standard, you see? So we got to carry ourselves as such, man. We're representing the powers of the heavens, man. You know? So that's why, hey, hey brothers, should, should, should watch what uh, 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 you put out, man. Watch your words, you know? Salaki, bear with me. This is um, Colossians, the fourth chapter, the fifth verse. It says, walk in wisdom toward them that are without redeeming the time. Let your speech be always with grace, seasoned with salt, that ye may know how ye ought to answer every man. Seasoned with salt. Salt is the wisdom, man. You know? So everything should be done a, 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 through the scriptures, man. Everything should be done through the spirit. The scripture says that King David moves, moved wisely in all his ways. Let's get that. In all his ways, man. Not, not some of his ways. This was this this what we must this what we striving to get to, man. This is first uh, Samuel 18 and 14. And David behaved himself wisely in all his ways. And Yahweh was with him, man. So we must behave ourselves. We must carry ourselves wisely in all the ways, man. We're learning how to be that serpent on the right hand side. You know. This is um, Ecclesiastes 10 and 1. It says dead flies cause the ointment of the apothecary to send forth a stinking savor. The apothecary, you go to the law, was a concoction of uh, uh, of smells that was put together, you know, of different herbs and different smells that was put together, man, to give a sweet savor to the Lord, you know, which was unlawful to recreate. Right. It says dead flies cause the ointment of the apothecary to send forth a stinking savor. Right. So do it a little folly, him that is in reputation for wisdom and honor. All it takes is for uh, uh, one of these scoffers or scorners, man, as it is written, man, the wicked watcheth the righteous to slay them. Not only Esau, but all these people, man, all these people want to bring up accusation against the men of the Lord just so they can uh, uh, have an excuse not to believe, man. You see? Oh, see, then, oh, he was doing that. Uh, see, there, there can't be a man of the Lord. He was doing, you, you know. That's why Yahweh Shah said a prophet is not known in his own home, man. 
Because here it is, our, our, our family members, the people that knew us before we came into the truth, they, 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 they knew our folly, man. So now that we waking up and now that we we walking the right path, they looking at us still like that little the little nigga they knew, man. Man, you still a little John John nigga. You know? So it says, so do it a little folly him that is in reputation for wisdom and honor. And that's why Sirach tells us this. This is Sirach 8 and 18. Do no secret thing before a stranger, for thou knowest not what he will bring forth, man. And Jake put all this shit out on social media, man. What you eating, where you going, all kind of madness, man. Oh, moo, pound, moo. Man, get that, man, that, man, make it, man. You see, do no secret thing before a stranger, for thou knowest what he will bring forth. Open not thy heart to every man, lest he requit thee with a shrewd turn, man. You know? And you got brothers posting all kind of stuff on social media, man. Look, 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 look. Calm down with that, man. Move in wisdom. You see? Majority of the people that's on social media is wicked ass niggas who ain't gonna get right, man. This devil, uh, 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 not only did uh, Esau eat him, but these scoffers and scorners, everybody is looking for one thing. To say something against us, man. Hey, but they ain't got shit to say against us, man. They shouldn't, they shouldn't have nothing against you but that you preach this word, man. And if they do bring something against you, it's false accusations. Oh, they're rapists. Oh, they, 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 they do this. They, they, it's, all, it, it's all lies and slander. You see, because they have nothing against us, man. That's why it says walk with wisdom uh, 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 to them that are without. Let's get back to that. That was Colossians four and five. It says walk in wisdom toward them that are without redeeming the time. Let your speech be always with grace, seasoned with salt, that ye may know how ye ought to answer every man. That ye may know how you ought to answer every man, even a scoffer and scorner, even the devil, even somebody that don't believe, man. You answer and steal with wisdom. You see? How did Paul handle uh, the different men that came against him, man? He was in that council. What did he do? He set them against each other, man. Through wisdom, that circumspection, through prudence, he perceived one half was Pharisees, one half was Sadducees, man. You know? And that's just a small example. Yahweh Shah, when he was set on trial, man, they, they, they had none. Uh, uh, they said no, uh, 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 none of the witnesses agreed together because they had, they had nothing uh, 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 solid to get him on, man. They came bearing false witness. And then the last thing that came up, uh, the last one came and said, this man said he would tear down the temple. And see, they accused him for what? Doing the work, man, for teaching. They had nothing else against him. We must be the same way, man. This is uh, 1 Thessalonians 4 and 12. It says that ye may walk honestly toward them that are without and that ye may have lack of nothing. You know, when you go into this, it's talking about working with your own hands, you know. But you, hey, hey, doing what you're supposed to do, man. Hey, hey, man. When these mother, man, we the most outstanding citizens in this goddamn place, man. You see? We work with our own hands. We ain't out there begging for money, man. I'm read it again. First Thessalonians 4 and 12. That ye, that ye may walk honestly toward them that are without, and that ye may have lack of of nothing man you know because the scriptures speak about this this is second corinthians 6 and 3 it says giving no offense in anything that the ministry be not blamed man you see because you're representing yahweh why yahweh shy man so you must be aware at all times, your actions, man, what you putting out, what you saying, the things that you putting out on social media, the things that you say on the comment board, the things that you put on the comment board during live shows, man. 
We must walk circumspectly, man. You know, we must deal in prudence. Knowing that this devil is watching, knowing that this devil is coming down. You know, I'm going to read it again. 2 Corinthians 6 and 3, giving no offense in anything that the ministry be not blamed. You know, hey, that's 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 why that damn the script. Hey, call all y'all by some y'all shot. Because I wasn't even trying to go to that Sirach 8, but the spirit had me bring it out. What I was looking for is uh, that's what I was looking for. Because it said a little folly make it the man of repu uh, uh, ruin a man of reputation, so to speak. That Ecclesiastes 10 and 1, roughly paraphrasing. But this is Sirach 20 and 31. Better is he that hideth his folly than a man that hideth his wisdom, man. You know? So it says do no secret thing in front of a stranger. It says a little uh, 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 a dead flies make the apothecary distinct. So a little folly to a man of reputation. You know, so it's just an encouragement of brothers to uh, 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 to be more circumspect, man. And it goes for myself first and foremost. To move more wisely in our ways, man, to really to really meditate and, and, and think about the moves we make, man, the things that we're doing. You know? So Lord willing, I hope and pray this was edifying. Till next time, all praises out and glory be to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Baracha Hakwadash, double honest to the apostles and elders, a great millstone, peace, blessings, salutations to all you brothers who preach in the gospel in truth and in sincerity, always in charity. Shalom.